Hey, it's the plug. Oh, hey. Anyone need a Lexus? You should, you should. Yeah. What's up, Mr. Plug? If you guys are wondering why he's the plug, hey Mike, hang tight, hang tight, come here. Let me see those Gucci's. It's guess, bro. It's oh, it's guess? Good. Oh, my bad. Sorry, bro. So what did we learn today, Mr. Paul? Mr. Paul. Uh, 40 inch tires get balanced somehow. Pull up in the Tesla Rosa. Trying to come up, but it just ain't your day, you little bitch. Hey, Should've got a little closer. Couldn't hear what Make the shit drop. Like it's hot in a pot full of lava. And up next, we have a Jeep that stopped by. Um, and it's gonna get a adjustment on the tires. Basically, we're gonna be doing beads. And the process of the beads is pretty unique. But man, it's a badass Jeep. It's a nice color, it's all done up. That's definitely a big boy's toy. Alex, take it straight. No. Straight. There you go. Just like that. Perfect. No, 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 no. Straight. Straight. Check both sides, guys, his angle. What do you think, Alex? You like it? Oh, heck yeah, I like it. I'll drive that any day. You have a thing for big cars, man. I know. I wonder what it is. Maybe I'm just small. <laughs> nah, man, you're fun size. You're snack size. Snack size? No, it is a badass Jeep. I'm not the biggest fan of Jeeps. They're fun. Um, I'm not too much into the off-road scene or climbing over shit. Cause if you let me, I will climb over your house. <laughs> so it's better if I don't have something like this. So it's a unique job right now, right Alex? Yeah. Gonna do the beads on this. We are. Do you mind explaining how that works? Uh, to be honest with you, I don't, I don't know how. You know what man, I appreciate honesty a thousand percent, right? So how does it work? Akio, how do beads work? So wheels at a certain speed have a rotational mass that if the wheel is in balance, the, the tire will, the tire and wheel will experience vibration. So what these beads do is, when you pour them into the wheel, whenever there is a um, imbalance in the wheel, the beads spread themselves out while the wheel or the entire are rotating to help kind of counterbalance and counteract that up and down. Uh, down uh, vibration so and man just take a look at these tires they're literally standing to Akio's waist there are some big boys look at that One of those 38 inch. these right here I think are 36 inch probably more you know, I like the 40 inch. Huh? 40, inch. 40 inch walls guys
Look how strong this guy is. He's holding the whole tire with one foot, bro. That's it, baby. Yeah. That's it. How you doing? Rock climbers. The car looks so innocent. And then you come over this way, and you see a hey, Alex, fat you tire. <laughs> oh, he does? Yeah. I think he just put it on. Massive tires. Did you rub when you were turning? Yeah. Oh, he probably might need a lower offset. <laughs> it's half of you. Jesus, look at that. This is beat talk? It's yeah. beat talk. Okay, what's going on, man? We're trying to determine whether or not it's actually three ounces that we need to use per tire for 40 inch tire, or if it's 12 ounces per tire. And Paul, I'm trying to skimp the client out on his bead. Mm, you're cheapo. You're trying to use those beads for later on tonight, aren't you? Always. Man, all this white stuff and gloves? I you swear you wouldn't think you're inside of a mechanic shop, performance shop. He's on test drive. I would hope so. Gotta take the Valcor out. Yeah, just take the Valcor out there. Yeah, this thing's moving. I know. <laughs> They're bouncing inside. Exactly. Yeah, and all the, all, exactly. Come on. <laughs> this is really funny, actually. <laughs> Come on. Every beat counts, man. <laughs> Damn, one beat at a time. It's the little hole. Oh no, no, you gotta cut it. Really? Yeah. You cut it to. No, oh, one beat at a time. <laughs> I mean, if you want to. <laughs> Should we cut it? Here. Let's just do a little test, huh? Yeah. See how suck this is gonna be. Right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> what is the blade? What is the blade? Here. Here. On your what? Oh, a Nissan Titan? Yeah. What about us? Lightweight. No, they're definitely cool. I'm, uh, I'm really interested in how this is going to pan out. Man, these are some big boys. Oh, hey. Hidden uh, components. Time for the big collars. Yes, sir. <laughs> it's, it's crazy. We usually work on only like performance cars, modified lower cars, um, and then something like this comes in we get a jeep or a truck build and these collars they're just they're so massive compared to what we usually use they're huge look at that and the ones that we usually use are like this big compared to that yeah you'll get it thursday and it ends up being saturday we're gonna look like fucking fools if you ever want to know what the struggle looks like it's definitely on paul's forehead that's the struggle. Or what used to be of my forehead. Right now, too. now it's Akio's forehead. <laughs> For sure. And back to the grind we go.